just wondering if you could start, it off, start us off uh, what kind of went into that decision in the second half uh, for you to come in. Yeah, as far as I know, we walked in the locker room and uh, OB just looked at me and just said, hey, you're starting off second half. And I said, yes, sir. And that was really about it. How did you feel the, you know, the first drive went and then what maybe resulted in not being able to carry what you did in the first drive forward um, as an offense after that? Yeah, I think that just comes down to me just doing my job. Um, incompletions, turnovers. Um, you know, that's just, it comes down to the quarterback. And I take that, that's on me in the second half. We started out hot, like you said, started out the first drive, marched right down, scored. And, you know, I have to be able to, you know, keep the team going and keep the ener energy up and keep it going throughout the second half. But I wasn't able to do that, and that's on me. Before the game, it was reported that you and Matt kind of split reps 50 50 during the week of practice. Do you, do you feel it was a kind of a true 50 50 split point? Yeah, I mean, I don't keep track of how many reps I get. Um, However many I get, I try to take advantage of it. So I can't tell you if it was exactly 50-50 or not. I don't think that's Coach Belichick's answer but or question. Um, but, yeah. Bailey, what was your understanding of your role heading into the game? Uh, try to help the team win. When, when did you learn that Mac would be starting quarterback? Um, you know, I think that's a private conversations that we have during the week. Um, I think that's a question for Coach Belichick on when he made the decision, but I'll keep that between you know us and the coaches. Bailey, if you do have a shot to start next week, there's obviously no bye week, right? There's not two weeks to lead up with like more reps to have. With a shorter week, if you were to start, would you prefer to know you know sooner rather than later? I mean, yeah, that's Coach Belichick's, Coach Belichick's decision. Um, you know, if I start, I'm gonna do everything I can, like I have, you know, the past times I started, and try to go out there and win. Bailey, take us to the last drive. You get the ball, and go through the ball. A little bit, and then you had some, some hiccups. Did you feel like you guys were going to be going for a touchdown there, or be disappointed that you only had to settle for the field goal attempt? Yeah, I mean, you know, the main part about that is to come out with the field goal. I mean, that's your main goal. It's 10-7. Um, worst case scenario is kick a field goal. Um, if you can score, great. Um, but, you know, our our main objective was to go down there, score points, and then not be able to give them the ball back. And we were able to do that. Um, you know, we should have never been in that position. First off, you know, that turnover. Um, that I had the pick, I mean, that led to their field goal. I mean, that's on me. So we should have never been in that position. Um, so I take that on me. What was the first half like for you? You know, you can see you on the sidelines, your helmet on, and kind of getting ready, getting ready, getting ready. How anxious were you to maybe get in there? And, and what, what was going through your mind at halftime that you came out knowing that you were going to get going? Yeah, just like you said, just staying ready. Um, staying locked into the game, seeing what the defense is doing to us in the first half, and just, you know, kind of taking mental reps on the side. Yeah, he just said, go out there and win. Bailey, and the, uh, Bailey, on the interception, was it just maybe come out of your hand and tickly, or was it just a great play by the safety? What exactly happened? Yeah, that's just bad by me. He made a great play. Um, you know, I'm sure there'll be a bunch of people that go back and look at it. He did a great job. He snipered the cross. Um, so that for me, that's I have to see that. So, I mean, that's totally on me. I could check it down to Taekwon. He was wide open in the flat. So, and it comes down to it. That's on the quarterback, and that's on me. Did it feel like it was difficult for you to prepare this week, not knowing what your role was going to be until until so late in the process? No, I mean I prepared the same way as I have, you know, the last however many weeks we've had. Were you pleased with that form overall? No. What what did what you like? What did you not like? I didn't like the interception. Does this feel like a missed opportunity? 100. percent If you don't win, it's a missed opportunity. For you, for you, you and for, in, for going forward. As in somebody is competing to play more, does it feel like you missed opportunity? I mean, I'm sure there were some good things, but there was a bad thing, and that was a turnover that led to a field goal that led to us losing. So, yeah, it's a missed opportunity. We didn't win. For your final question? Bailey, how much would you like now to maybe breathe and have a full week to prepare as that starter? How much are you looking forward to maybe that opportunity where you can just go out, hold live, you know what's going to happen, and get out there and just kind of try to lead this team to? Yeah, that'd be great. But again, that's Coach Belichick's decision. Whatever he decides, I do it. Um, if he wants to do it, whatever, I'll do whatever he says. Thank you, Bailey. Yep.